Hello and welcome to 15 Minute Game. My name is Tony and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more videos. Hello fellow citizens and welcome to the channel. So let's take a look at what's coming up this week in Star Citizen. On Tuesday, the narrative team will continue their action-packed story of part 2 of Lost Squad Before the Fall. I didn't check out part 1, so I think I might do that after recording this video, give it a bit of a read and see what it's all about. On Wednesday, they'll announce the winners of the Intergalactic Cook-Off and First Contact Contest. So if you enter that, good luck with that. On Thursday will of course be the latest episode of Inside Star Citizen. Our weekly look behind the scenes of Star Citizen development, which takes a deeper dive into the upcoming flight and fight improvements. It's quite hard to say that. Coming to the verse with our upcoming patch, this is of course the patch 3.10, which is currently in, in Eva Carty. It should go out onto the PTU servers by the end of the week, I hope. Hope. Obviously, there's no confirmation on that. And then to the wider verse within the first week of July, I reckon. It can't be much later than that because it needs to be out there by then. So, yeah, we'll see how it goes. However, I have heard there's a few issues within Eva Carty. So, they'll want to iron them out first. And on Friday, you'll see a roadmap update and roundup, an update to Subscriber Vault. The RSI newsletter will be delivered direct to your inbox alongside the latest issue of Jump Point. A new episode of Calling All Devs will be uploaded to the RSI YouTube channel with more information about PvP gameplay, which I know a lot of people are excited about. And it's one thing that does let Star Citizen down a little bit is the PvP. But that's not all. If you plan on exploring the new flight update with your car to Al, I have some good news for you. The ship will receive an update in Alpha 3.10. This is to improve its handling, defensive, and offensive capabilities. It's about time because that is an awesome ship. And unfortunately, it's a little bit let down by a few things. So that's quite exciting. And there we go, guys. That's what we can look forward to in Star Citizen this week. I'm excited for this week. It should be a good one. Um, I've upgraded my fleet to include the Freelancer Max. So I've been getting into cargo running a little bit. Dangerous game to play. With all the 30k errors and griefers and stuff like that. But so far, so good. So I'll be continuing that during the week. I'm excited for 3.10 to drop with lots of changes. Because there's flight models, there's, oh, there's new buildings and new Babbage and stuff. So I'm excited for this one coming up. So let me know below what you're excited for. How the verse is going for you. And if you're looking forward to anything. And I'll catch you as all later. Goodbye.